Bill O'Reilly wanted to weigh in on the Matai Teo uh, debacle that's going on right now. Now, we're not going to talk about that Thank that much. You. We did that last night, so we've covered that. But he had some interesting things to say about can, the internet and the... Can, the I, can I ask you, Guy? I'm new to this story. This uh -huh. just broke, right? Like yesterday? A couple days, two days ago. Okay, <laughs> so I've been busy uh, reading uh, Tumblr. book reviews. And, um, <laughs> so what, ha what happened? So this guy had a girlfriend. Then somebody did some investigation. He said his girlfriend died of mm -hmm. leukemia. It turns out there's no girlfriend, there no girlfriend. and so they're then now they're trying to say that he was hoodwinked, which that we're skeptical of that, correct? Yes. Okay, so that's where we're we at. think that he's making it up. Okay. Yes. For and publicity. For or publicity. To hide his man or or to like hide that. his private life. That, that that's oh. possibly true as well. Okay. Because he is he is a Mormon, so there's a possibility. Oh, that. okay. Not not because he's a Mormon, but that that plays into it in any event. Uh, Bill O'Reilly is uh, he he's using this Matai Teo scandal to realize that the internet is out there and bad <laughs> things sometimes happen on it. Uh, he didn't know about it, but but let's let's actually let's let him describe it in his own terms. He has some some harsh words for the internet. Whether we know it or not, all of us are being influenced by the net. The machines have changed everything in our lives. <laughs> And as you know, if you use the internet, there's a tremendous evil available <laughs> at your fingertips. Do not, do not allow the machines to take control of your life. Don't do that. Evil operates best when it's hidden. The net is a great place to hide. Now, for, for context what purposes, he had just finished watching a great documentary series called The Matrix. And so he was very nervous about what this could mean for the future of humanity. Um, but but he's, he's worried. Riley. Yeah, I feel a little bit bad for him. Now, look, it, eventually I'm going to get on to how I think that he might actually have a point there. But I do think it's interesting. He's like, there's great evil at your fingertips. Yeah. <laughs> That's not how I manipulate my mouse anyway. What's right. he doing with his fingertips? Well, where was there's great temptation. That's how you type. That's, where, that's how I you guess. hold a loofah in your <laughs> fingertips. I think that he does actually have somewhat of a point okay. that, I think that, look, now Matt Taylor probably lying about the, the girlfriend situation, but people do get duped in some of these online relationships. Of course they do, but Bill O'Reilly is making, he's making a religious point. Okay. He's Tell using the word evil yes. over and over. He's trying to say that the devil is lurking in the interwebs uh -huh. and, and you're right. susceptible to it as soon as you open, you know, Netscape or whatever he browser say, yeah, he's using. Um, yeah, yeah, and so so <laughs> certainly Safari's evil. Certainly. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah certainly. Um, uh, it's just it's really cute. Yes. It's just kind of cute. The old isn't man it? found the computer. I know. <laughs> it's the I mean, use of the word machine. The machines, the machines over exactly. And over. It's a series exactly. of tubes. Exactly. <laughs> Speak into the machine.